it's not your first time in Moscow. What was your first impression when you come here? Uh, yeah, it's not my first time. I was at semi-final with uh, Croatian fans when Croatia plays uh, with uh, England. And uh, I came to the Red Square and it was like beautiful, you know. And now when I'm uh, second time here, my impressions are... Phew, city is very big uh, you uh, from the camp to the center you have one hour so it's for me very 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 big city uh, what did you hear about moscow before coming here all the best really it's uh, the best city in europe it's uh, very nice it's so big it's you have everything uh, but also i heard the uh, problems with the traffic <laughs> and now why so why uh, which uh, site uh, impressed you the most the red square Yes, maybe Kremlin, Red Square, yes. And also, uh, when you drive to the city, you can see really, really nice buildings, big roads, and that's awesome. What was your first reaction when you found out that Dynamo is interested in you? Uh, I was uh, so happy because uh, I know Dynamo is a big club with a big history and uh, it's a big uh, step forward for me. And uh, I hope uh, with the team we, we can achieve a big goals this season. How long did it take you to decide to move here? Maybe three, uh, three, to, uh, three four days. I uh, called some uh, important people to me and uh, in a conversation with them I decided to come in Moscow. Did you watch the Russian Premier League before? Yes, because I have some friends from Croatia here and uh, I watched uh, their games. Yes. Uh, what's your main goal in Dynamo? Main goal for me is uh, to improve here. I can. I think in this uh, Premier League of Russia, I can uh, make big uh, progress in the future. And also with the team, I want to uh, win uh, some uh, cups, championship, qualify for Europe. Also. Yeah. I know that you are in touch with Nikola Vlasic. Have you consulted with him before coming here? Yes, he is one of the my friends which I called before I uh, come here. Yeah, he told me it's a good, good step for me, a good club, and uh, he told me all the best about Russia and Moscow. Who else did you help to take the decision? Tony Shunic? Uh, I didn't talk with him. Before I uh, decided, I talked with uh, my ex-coach Nenad Bielica from Dynamo and uh, also with my manager, with my uh, family and uh, at the end I, it was my choice. Have you heard about the Croatian player who played for Dynamo Moscow? Yes, I know this uh, Schirnefeld, he was there, he was here and uh, also from Dynamo was uh, Fatos Bechirai. And uh, who was, who else is someone else? Dujmovic. Ah, Dujmovic, yeah, 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 I know that guy. And do you know any Dynamo legends like Lev Yashin? Yes, I know. He's the only one, but uh, yes, I know. He's a legend. Uh, you often compare it uh, to one of the most famous uh, Croatian players, like you called New Modric. Uh, are you flattered with this comparison or it's annoying? Ah, you know, it's... Uh, <laughs> When you are in the same uh, world with uh, Modric, it's a big honor. But I don't, uh, uh, I don't feel some pressure because because of that. Because uh, I think uh, I have my style of play. I I will uh, make a career with uh, my style of play. Not uh, he's one of my idols, but okay. I am Nicola Mora, you know. Uh, you can play in the center of the field at any position, but uh, what position are the most comfortable for you? In middle I can play every position, and uh, but the last season, last two seasons, I played number six, like defensive midfielder, but also I like to play a little uh, offensive. You joined Dynamo on Tuesday and the very next day you already spent your first uh, minutes in Russian Premier League. Did you expect that your debut will come so quickly? Yes, that was so fast. I didn't expect, uh, but uh, coach gave me a chance and uh, I, I think it was okay for David and uh, in the next games I think it will be much better. 
What's your impression about the stadium and the fans that greeted you and uh, you greeted them after the game with the team? Yes, with the team after the win. It's uh, the best feeling to clap with fans. And uh, also, when I came to the stadium, I was like, you know, in Croatia you don't have this modern uh, big stadiums and uh, I really, really like the arena. Croatian and Russian languages have the similar words. Would you like to learn Russian? Of course, I want uh, to learn Russia. It's uh, a little similar, not too much, but uh, some like Dobry den, Dobre jutra and some other uh, things I know to say. Спасибо за поддержку, Динамовцы. Thank you. Интерактивное зеркало заднего вида. Поместится все, что дорого вашему сердцу. Абсолютно новый Chevrolet Traverse.